Good cartography is not just about colors and symbols, it's also about the words on your map. Hi, I'm Heather, and I'm a cartographer. When I review a map, I almost always recommend changing the layer names. These appear in the legend and in layer widgets. Even if you're just sending the map to a colleague to collaborate on, that collaboration is going to be a lot easier if the map is clear. In this map, I have three layers with the default names they came with. I'll start with collisions underscore and underscore streets per dissemination area. That's the red and orange polygon layer. So do the red areas have more collisions and streets? What does that mean? And per area, how much area? A unit of measurement would help. I made this layer so I know it's actually the number of traffic collisions divided by the summarized length of all road segments in each dissemination area. Now that's too much of a mouthful for a layer name but traffic collisions per kilometer of road is just great. Next we have the street center lines layer. Is the word center lines necessary? No, so I'll remove it. Shorter names are better. And finally, traffic collisions. This layer name doesn't need to be shortened, but I will change it to be consistently formatted like the others. They're using sentence case, so it should as well. Consistency is a really big part of clarity, and I don't want my map to look like it has typos. Finally, I'll look at the map name, Traffic Collisions. Again, not bad. However, are there any lingering questions about this map? For example, when did these collisions take place? I can put that information in the map's title, Traffic Collisions, 2018 to present. I could also put it in the layer name, but there's no need to be redundant, especially because we're trying to keep these names short. Put it in the map name or the layer name, but not both. Let's take a look at the legend. There's still a lot of words here that I haven't accounted for. They are field names, not layer names. I'll select the layer and open the fields pane to change their display names. Count of points can be number of collisions, and summarized length in kilometers can be km of road. So, just by changing a few words, I've made this map a lot easier to understand. Cartography is about communicating clearly, and that doesn't only apply to symbols. The symbols can be excellently designed, but if the layer names describing them aren't clear, they're not much use. Try this little improvement in your own map.